Alright, alright. I'm gonna cut the countdown right now. Hello and welcome! <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I went to the Zuzu just then. Alright. Yeah, a bit uh, Kazoo esque. Alright, let's be serious now. I've been, I've been doing my homework and I'm ready to go and finish the first game. So, alright. Planning today, I want to try just uh, to finish the first game. I don't remember if I've uh, finished that one. I think so. So we try to beat the last night. Then we can move and try uh, the second game and then some fun games. That seems a lot, but uh, I think we're gonna move pretty quickly here. All right, all right. Let's go. Gameplay. So here we are, the first game, uh, I think we were on the fifth night last time, let's go. I think the computer is going to be working better now, <laughs> yeah. Alright. <coughs> Fourth night, oh man. Well. Let's try to at least uh, move past that and chat a little bit. So I think uh, I think I got a bit uh, more used to speaking out loud in English uh, than last time. Yeah, I know my accent is uh, still not right there, but uh, it's it's helping slowly. It's helping me improve a bit. So fourth night. Um, I don't remember the fourth night if there's something special. Hello. Yeah, I know they start to roam a bit uh, faster now. And Fox is already there. Bon is already there. When Shika is cooking something, what the heck was? <laughs> At the end of the day, this it is uh, FNAF games are still kind of funny to the two men. I love the designs, the lore, the characters, but uh, they still make me laugh. I do enjoy them, but I can't take them too seriously either. Where's that rabbit? There's the rabbit. Did someone try to make a Looney Tunes mod of... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> With Bugs Bunny, or Daffy Duck, etc. I think this is running nicely. Well, it's not a really complicated game, but uh, it's working better now. Fred is on the loose. And Foxy as well. Let's try to save some power. That's ready. 
this means is not that far off. <laughs> Let's see. So, Freddy, <laughs> I'd love to get uh, some uh, FNAF merch, but uh, here uh, you can't find anything, uh, even the toys. I know you can find the toys everywhere in some other countries, but uh, here you can find some uh, Poppy Playtime uh, stuff, but uh, FNAF, I haven't seen anything yet. Stupid chicken. Ah! Sixty percent. Yeah, I don't think we we're going to make it. first game is kind of about luck, because uh, if they keep uh, bothering you, you can save. Is coming for you. Come on, three AM. I think Freddy wants to kill me. Come on. And Foxy now. Everyone wants to kill me. Cheers. <laughs> All right, he got me. What time was um, was it? Um, Four a.m. already. I love the old three D models. They're so nice. All right. We'll try one more time, and then we'll move to something else. Well, it's not a walkthrough, it's just the lore. The lore! I always say that there should be an easter egg with the nose. Like giving a little power... Just a 2% something. The chicken's on the loose, the bunny is on the loose, the fox is about to attack me. Let's wait. And... Right... There.
from Chica. Freddy's gone away. The problem is that I don't remember what Freddy used to do. Sweet. Fred is in the kitchen. So today's uh, uh, today's T-shirt is. coming for you. You can do it! Foxy? Yeah. What if they could talk? Hey, it's Freddy! Hey, guys! Hey, it's Foxy! Hey, come on! Ah, he's a pirate. Who's that? Chica over there. Foxy over there. 3 m Hmm. 48. Hmm. I think we can still make it for now. Yeah, just lose some power. Oh no! Not that guy. Let's try to... S this means Freddy is coming. But God darn it. 
Can we swear on Twitch? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, but not on YouTube when I upload it later. Oh well. Yeah. I don't want to do the same thing too much, so we're here to just have fun. So let's move to uh, the second game. I haven't played the second game in a really long time, so I don't remember the rules and etc. I remember the third and fourth game more. Bye! Alright. Let's launch the second game just for fun. It's the least played. I only played uh, 19 minutes of this one. I played them on the on the phone, but uh, yeah, this one, yeah. Night two. Yeah, let's start from the start. Help! One tab. Oh. I see that's where it go it comes from. <laughs> when we have thing, vintage pizza around here. Eh? Come to eh? what will go wrong? Oh, oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I remember. Uh, yeah. Hello. Hello? Hello? Uh, hello and welcome to your new summer job as a new and improved Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Uh, I'm here to talk you through some of the things you can expect to see during your first week here and to help you get started down this new and exciting career path. Lights. Uh, now, I want you to forget anything you may have heard about Lights. the old location. You know, uh, some people still have a somewhat negative impression of the company. Man, I can I can deny I did draw Toy Chica once or twice. Oh yeah, the mask. I, yeah, that I remember to avoid the ones that come on the sides. I mean, come on. The music box, man, I forgot this. I think on the first night, it's okay. This looks nice. God. <laughs> I, for, I, I forgot this one, this guy, right there. That's the, that's the cre creepiest one. Oh yeah, there's a uh, mango as well. I'm trying to remember the, the rules. What are the rules? Yeah. You don't. These ones you don't need to check. These ones from time to time. This one. The music box goes way too fast. It's funny, the, the models are a bit uh, less polished in this game. And here we go!
Ooh, you can use the, the flashlight. Oh! Hi. What the heck? Toy Freddy is really uh, freaky. Got them. What's that? What's that thing? <laughs> I don't remember anything from this game. <gasps> the music box! Feel it's out of the box already. Already, you see, Toy Freddy is a lot uh, creepier than the original. Oh man, the puppet! God, I hate this puppet. I like the story, uh, the tears, etc., but uh, yeah. Oh, there's the originals uh, as well, yeah. Man, this uh, second game is a lot harder. No! They can come from here, man. I think you have to flash uh, a few times, right? I don't remember a thing. The music box got. Go away! Shoot! on this way. Hey, he's still there, no? Oh! <laughs> Toy Chica doesn't stop. Oh, man! There's a lot of stuff to, to do in the in the gameplay loop. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was pretty easy, you see. It's a really uh, easy game for kids, you know. <laughs> yeah, she, she really wants it uh, in here, yeah. What's going on? Come on, Scott, tell us. Wait, what did you mean with this one? Hello? 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 Uh, hello? Hello? Uh, yeah, I told you your first night wouldn't be a problem. You're a natural. Uh, yeah, sure. Almost died, but sure. The music box already finishing. Yeah, 
Yeah, if they get in, the mask works. Fox is in this game. Oh yeah, it means the, the old Foxy, yeah. The old ones attack on the, the Seven Knight? I thought they come uh, a bit later in the game. Yeah. Whoa! Foxy's uh, mangoes up there! There's a really good fun game with uh, Mango in the servers. I think I like uh, FNAF fun games more than the real ones. <laughs> Got... <laughs> it's here! What the heck? She lost the parrot on the shoulder. Uh, Mangle's coming! Oh yeah, the... I d never noticed this, the, the thing... Uh, hello! What's the... <laughs> hello! Creepy kids. Foxy? Yeah, makes sense. Makes sense. Who killed me? My, uh, Foxy? I just noticed this. So there's no power usage in this one. No power. But there's so many things to keep uh, track of. So far, so good. What can we do here? Nothing. I'm waiting for 2 a.m. to start. Pl oh, the music box, the music box, the music box. Is mango. Oh, 
who's there? There's some kind of chicken right there, and my light doesn't work. Oh, not this guy! Hello! 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 The music <laughs> Ah, oh, Foxy! Scary Foxy! I don't know what to do with Mango. Got them. That's the scariest thing in this series. Hi. Hello. Balloons. Leave. Leave. Someone kill that balloon kid. It gets real, uh, real complicated uh, on the second night. So, you have the toy ones. They are the easy ones. You have the puppet. With, which is kind of okay, but you have to keep um, grinding the, the music. Uh, we have the old ones already, well, at least Foxy. I don't know what to do with this one. Just uh, the lights. Balloon Boy, who stops uh, making things work around. Toy, Toy Freddy is really creepy. Then you have Balloon Boy that looks like uh, a spawn from L. <laughs> and uh, who's the scary one? Foxy. Ah, and Mango. Yeah, in Mango, I'm not sure what you have to do. Avoid looking at Mango directly. Maybe I, I I like we made the game. The first game was uh, the first game is uh, the be uh, the best one. It works nice. It has a nice flow, a nice gameplay loop. The second game has a ton of stuff going around at the same time. It it overwhelms the player. You know what? Let's try something else, but still. Uh, Let's leave the, the real games aside and uh, just have a little fun with some of the fun games. At least some of the the more normal, classic uh, fun games. First up, I already picked the games actually. Yeah, let's. So this is no, no, not this one. Um, This one after. I forgot the name. <laughs> I forgot the name. It's 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 it's. it's I looked at the game before, I already forgot the name. It's uh, before, yeah, that one. All right, 
So let's try some fun games that aren't too far of the original gameplay. So this one is before before Freddy, I think. All these fun games can be found on Game Jolt. Alright. So here we have something a bit uh, simpler. It's basically uh, the first game. Before Freddy. Let's start from the start. We got the four question symbols so with each animation. They flash more and more as they grow because. Uh, yeah, normal. Sure. Yeah, I just wanna try. <laughs> so this game is supposed to be uh, to take place before the original game. So it's a bit simpler. finish the game <laughs> so it looks a bit simpler you don't have a lot of stuff to do it's like a prequel or something at least you know the game is okay when you can do this Good day, mate. <laughs> so it's supposed to be a prequel. Let me fill you in on your task for the next five days. You simply need to use the security camera system to monitor the animatronic characters and make sure that they are functioning properly. At the end of the week, Foxy uh, is over there for some reason. Boring, right? Wrong. The animatronics have a night roaming mode enabled to make sure these surveys don't lock up. Which is a little bit buggy. As the nights progress, they may become more active. Now, I guess the first thing you notice is that uh, you have limited power. As for entertainment has returned with a much smaller budget, so all of our buildings have limited power. It makes working with these animatronics quite difficult. Your office uses one third of power, which is constant, but isn't too bad. The camera system uses a third also. It's quite a mess. System. Images may glitch out at times. It's actually the same system. So it's like uh, the original pizzeria in the um, old days <laughs> before they made everything else. And then the lights for the whole building use the vast third of power. Your power will drain extremely quickly using all the lights, so use it sparingly. Now here's the part that might scare you. The animatronics can be very dangerous at night. I'll explain this in depth. Twenty years ago, the animatronics Freddy, Bonnie, Chica and Foxy were retrofitted with a night mode, which was buggy, along with facial recognition as a test. Someone had tampered with the facial recognition afterwards, and it resulted in the death of an employee. No one's quite sure what animatronic killed the employee, but we kept four of them and trashed the rest, in case we opened up one day. <coughs> Some of those animatronics are here with you right now, with the bug night mode. The bug moment means that they will just simply roam around the building and join the night scenes. They'll most likely go to the right there. Visiting the office. And Foxy right that. there. Alright. Now, the danger is then spotting you. If they look at you for long enough, they will forcefully try to stuff you into an empty Freddy Fazbear suit. Why? Well, they'll see you as a bare endoskeleton made out of suit on, so they will try and assist you. Why? Oh, we don't know. They just like to kill people. The suits won't feel the cross beams and wires. So it's quite deadly. I mean, we built the rest of the pizzeria over yeah. an old cemetery, so but and we used uh, so some so dead bodies to, to make the animatronics, but you know. Make sure it's dark. <laughs> Stay out of your office because once the generator stops turning, the animatronics will learn to listen closer for faint sounds, such as breathing or body movements. 
Like oh yeah, in this no one, you have to stop them. moving when they are around you. Etc. Good night, mate. Good night, bud. See ya. Alright. 3 a.m. Yeah, looking okay so far. So, this game is like the first one, but um, with less uh, CCTVs. <laughs> No, I mean, uh, they're here, but uh, you only uh, really need to check two or three. They don't move as much. You have to stop moving around. And you can shut down the power. I like the, the idea of uh, an early days. Uh, It's Bonnie. Bonnie is moving around. Yeah. I don't see him. Oh yeah. I feel like time moves really fast in this one. In the real games you can hear the sounds, the footsteps. In the fan games, they never notice that many uh, details for the player. And... Oh yeah, it's just a four, five... Yeah, that... <laughs> Man. Chica's coming as well. Bonnie and Chica's uh, are on the either side. I have 20%. It's 5 a.m. I think we can make it. Let's shut down the power! <laughs> I really like the, the way he walked around. I'm doing the robot. Do I turn the power on or wait for 6 a.m.? You can do it! I don't know what to do! <laughs> Stupid rabbit!
That's the goriest sounds. What the? F sure, go ahead. No worries. I'm gonna try another round and then uh, we'll move to uh, one last game. system to monitor the animatronic characters and make sure that they are functioning properly. At the end of the work period, give us reports on the activity. <laughs> Boring, right? Wrong. The animatronics have a night roaming mode enabled to make sure their servos don't lock up, which is a little bit buggy. As the nights progress, they may become more active. Now, I guess the first thing you notice is that uh, you have limited power. Bass Band Entertainment has returned with a much smaller budget, so all of our buildings have limited power. It makes working with these animatronics quite difficult. Your office uses one third of power, which is constant, but isn't too bad. The camera system uses a third also. It's quite an old system, the images may glitch out at times when you're using the cameras. It's actually the same system from Restaurant 97, that's something we managed to scavenge. Uh, you know, smaller budget, had to save some money, so we just scavenged small systems. And then the lights for the whole building use the last third of power. Your power will drain extremely quick when using all the lights, so use it sparingly. Now here's the part that might scare you. The animatronics can be very dangerous at night. I'll explain this in depth. Right. Twenty years ago, the well. animatronics Freddy and Bonnie, Chica and Foxy were retrofitted with a night mode, which is buggy, along with facial recognition as a test. Someone had tampered with the facial recognition afterwards, and it resulted in the death of an employee. No one's quite sure what animatronic killed the employee, but we kept four of them and trashed the rest in case we opened up one day. <clears throat> Some of those animatronics are here with you right now with the bug nightmare. The bug nightmare means that they will just simply roam around the building and they'll most likely uh, pop up and visit you in your office. How exciting is that? Now, the danger is them spotting you. If they look at you for long enough, they will forcefully try to stuff you into an empty Freddy Fazbear suit. Why? Well, they'll see you as a bare endoskeleton without a suit on, so they will try and assist you with getting one on. Which wouldn't be so bad if the suits weren't filled with cross beams and wires, so it's quite deadly. <laughs> Alright, let's go. To avoid this happening, there is a little to the right. It is wired to the main generator outside. So, so using it will turn off all power on and off as you please. What you do is you turn the power off and let the animatronics head back towards the generator as it still produces some noise. But the animatronics could any office while they're moving, so don't worry if this happens, just make sure it's dark and keep still, let them walk past. You must turn the power back on once they are out of your office, because once the generator stops turning, the animatronics will learn to listen closer for faint sounds, such as breathing or body movements. Because they mm. like if there's if there's no noise somewhere they will look for noise which will be you have to cut to shut down power when they come and stop moving. Now, if you're feeling scared or skeptical about watching our animatronics, do not worry. All the happenings of Fazbear and Treasure Entertainment are in the past. The animatronics responsible have pretty much all have been disposed of. <coughs> okay, so now you're all filled in. Keep an eye on the animatronics, conserve power, log all activity, and I'll talk to you again tomorrow night. 
Good night, man. Right, the game really starts at 3 a.m. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Mm -mm -mm. Now, Bonnie, and he's right there. All right. Go away. Yeah. I'm ready for you, you, you. And you as well. The sounds play at random, or it's to notice someone moving around. Let's try to wait five. Yeah, good. Not bad, not bad. We're doing well. Yeah. Yeah. Too slow, too slow. Yeah, stop, 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 stop. I know. Let's check the time. Yeah, one last. I want to get to night, uh, night two. I wanna get to night two. So, until three am, nothing. Hello, good day, good day, mate. Good day. Hey man. Answer the damn phone. Good day. Good day. Good day. Good day, mate. I'd personally like to thank you for volunteering. I hope you're a night owl because you'll be staying up from 12 a.m. to 6 a.m. for the next five days. Which you already know about. 
If not, we'll grab a cup of coffee and get to work. Let me fill you in on your task for the next five days. You simply need to make use of our security camera system to monitor the animatronic characters and make sure that they are functioning properly. At the end of the work period, give us reports on the activity. Boring, right? Wrong. The animatronics have a night roaming mode enabled to make sure their servos don't lock up, which is a little bit buggy. As the nights progress, they may become more active. Now, I guess the first thing you notice is that uh, you have limited power. Mass Band Entertainment has returned with a much smaller budget, so all of our buildings have limited power. It makes working with these animatronics quite difficult. Your office uses one third of power, which is constant, but isn't too bad. The camera system uses a third also. It's quite an old system, the images may glitch out at times when you're using the cameras. It's actually the same system from Ghost Runner 87, that's something we managed to scavenge. Uh, you know, smaller budget, had to save some money, so we just scavenged some more systems. And then the lights for the whole building use the last third of power. Your power will drain extremely quick when using all the lights, so use it sparingly. Now here's the part that might scare you. The animatronics can be very dangerous at night. I'll explain this in depth. Twenty years ago, the animatronics Freddy, Bonnie, Chica and Foxy... Were Twenty years ago? ...which was buggy, along with facial recognition as a test. Someone attempted with the facial recognition afterwards and it resulted in death of I'm not sure what animatronic killed the employee, but we kept four of them and trashed the rest in case we opened up one day. <clears throat> Some of those animatronics are here with you right now with the bug nightmare. The bug nightmare means that they will just simply roam around the building during the night and they'll most likely uh, pop up yeah, and visit you. I'm office. just waiting for the start. Now, the danger is them spotting you. If they look at you for long enough, they will forcefully try to stuff you into an empty Freddy Fazbear suit. Why? Well, they'll see you as a bare endoskeleton without a suit on, so they will try and assist you with getting one on. Which wouldn't be so bad if the suits weren't filled with cross beams and wires, so it's quite deadly. And worse than the spring locks, actually. <coughs> to avoid this happening, there is a little console to your right. It is wired into the main generator outside. So, so using it will turn off all power on and off as you please. What you do is you turn the power off and let the animatronics head back towards the generator as it still produces some noise. But the animatronics could any office while they're moving, so don't worry if this happens, just make sure it's dark and keep still, let them walk past. You must turn the power back on once they are out of your office, because once the generator stops turning, the animatronics will learn to listen closer for faint sounds, such as breathing or body movements. They, like if there's if there's no noise somewhere, they will look for noise, which will be in your office. They look for noise. It's quite bad, so don't try sitting in the dark. And now, if you're feeling scared or skeptical about watching our animatronics, do not worry. All the happenings of Fazbear and Fredbear Entertainment are in the past. The animatronics responsible have pretty much all have been disposed of. Good night. Good night. <coughs> We're gonna make it. All right. Waiting for four him. Waiting. Waiting right here.
right let's try to make it there's still hope so far I think when we get to five What the f Yeah, that's the first time I saw this guy. I didn't even knew he was in the game. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. night two. It's too late. I have to. Without Shadow Freddy, I would have made it. I'm pretty sure. Let's get back to it. First, we wait. Day mate, day mate. I'm just setting uh, wallpapers on my phone. Good day, good day, good day, good day, good day, mate. I'd personally like to thank you for volunteering. I hope you're a night owl because you'll be staying out from 12 a.m. to 6 a.m. for the next five days, which you already know about. If not, we'll grab a cup of coffee and get to work. Let me fill you in on your task for the next five days. You simply need to make use of our security camera system to monitor the animatronic characters and make sure that they are functioning properly. At the end of the work period, give us reports on the activity. <laughs> Boring, right? Wrong. The animatronics have a night roaming mode enabled to make sure their servos don't lock up, which is a little bit buggy. As the nights progress, they may become more active. Now, I guess the first thing you notice is that uh, you have limited power. Aspen Entertainment has returned with a much smaller budget, so all of our buildings have limited power. It makes working with these animatronics quite difficult. Your office uses one third of power, which is constant, but isn't too bad. The camera system uses a third also. It's quite an old system. The images may glitch out at times when you're using the cameras. It's actually the same system from Restaurant 87. That's something we managed to scavenge. Uh, just, you know, smaller budget, had to save some money, so we just scavenged small systems. And then the lights for the whole building use the last third of power. Your power will drain extremely quick when using all the lights, so use it sparingly. Now here's the part that might scare you. The animatronics can be very dangerous at night. I'll explain this in depth. 20 years ago, the animatronics Freddy, Bonnie, Chica and Foxy were retrofitted with a night mode, which was buggy, along with facial recognition as a test. Someone had tampered with the facial recognition afterwards, and it resulted in the death of an employee. No one's quite sure what animatronic killed the employee, but we kept four of them and trashed the rest in case we opened up one day. It's basically uh, a sequel <laughs> to the bite, uh, the original bite in the storyline. The bug nightmare means that they will just simply roam around the building during the night, and they'll most likely uh, pop up and visit you in your office. How exciting is that? Now, the danger is them spotting you. If they look at you for long enough, they will forcefully try to stuff you into an empty Freddy Fazbear suit. Why? Well, they'll see you as a bare endoskeleton with the other suit on, so they will try and assist you with getting one on. Which wouldn't All right. be so bad if the Almost there. Cross beams crossbeams and wires, so it's quite deadly. Worse than the spring locks, actually. <coughs> to avoid 
where this is happening, there is a little console to your right. It is wired to the main generator outside. So, so using it will turn off all power on and off as you please. What you do is you turn the power off and let the animatronics head back towards the generator as it still produces some noise. But the animatronics could any office while they're moving, so don't worry if this happens, just make sure it's dark and keep still, let them walk past. You must turn the power back on once they are out of your office, because once the generator stops attempting, the animatronics will learn to listen closer for faint sounds, such as breathing or body movements, because they... Like, if there's, if there's no noise somewhere, they will look for noise, which will be in your office. It's, just quite, it's quite bad, so don't try sitting in a dark all night, or you may regret it. Now, if you're feeling scared or skeptical about watching our animatronics, do not worry. All the happenings of Fazbear and Fredbear Entertainment are in the past. The animatronics responsible pretty much all the issues. Okay, so now you're all filled in. Keep an eye on the animatronics, conserve power, log all activity, and I'll talk to you again tomorrow night. Good night, mate. Good night. See ya, bud. All right, we're back, we're ready, we're feeling it. Come at me, bro. Come on, kill me, I'm over here, come on. Yeah, I think I do an okay uh, Arnold, right? I'm over here, kill me. Get to the chopper! Alright, alright... 4 a.m. We gonna make it! Or not, I don't know. Don't kill me. Come on, kill me. Yeah. Shadow Freddy, no tricks, no nothing, 46, here we go, here we go, 5 a.m., yes, here we go. Here we go. Power. Yes, yes. Yes. Foxy. God damn it. 
No! Don't come! We gonna make it? Yes? Yeah? Three, two, one. <laughs> that was easy. So easy. All right. All right. Now the goal is a bit easier. Let's just survive and then change the game. Hello, hello. Good day, good day. Good day, mate. Good day, good day. Good job on your first night, mate. I hope nothing scary happened. <laughs> so tonight there should be a little bit more activity, so you'll be kept busy. Again, I must point out you did great work last night, but I'm not sure if you moved the animatronics back to their stage or if they did it themselves, but everything was basically reset when we came in yesterday morning. Oh, if you no. keep this up, we will consider you for the position of Lucas's Pizza as the night guard when it opens. It would be basically the same thing, but you would have more power, lights always on the building, We'll and doors. And yeah, about. survive. We'll give. We'll give you a few doors. So I sure. Foxy all night last night, uh, waiting for him to move. Well, he will be tonight. He was disabled last night. That animatronic was in terrible condition, but it's still somewhat functional. He is quite different to the others, actually. He thrives in the dark. He hates light and being watched over. So if you don't want him to come running down the east hall. Uh, you'll have to check up on him by viewing the back room on the cameras and hold the light on him for about two to three seconds every now and then. If you don't do this, he'll most, li he'll most likely begin to move a little bit closer towards the party room. Once he comes to the party room, he'll come running. So be sure to check on him. Remember, don't stay in the dark for too long. So yeah, that's basically all I needed to talk to you about tonight. Keep an extra eye out for Foxy and have a good night, mate. Right, so we have to, to get, keep an eye on Foxy now. And Bonnie. We'll see, we'll see how it goes. I don't really care that much. One, two, three, four. Nobody's moving. That's nice. Waiting for three.
right this is it coming go not you again uh. all right that was uh, before Freddy's Nice uh, game that doesn't look uh, that bad and feels uh, plays like an actual game. Yeah, we'll go. We'll come back to this uh, some other time. And let's try one last game. One last game. Another another fun game that uh, tries uh, that aims to be uh, to feel like an actual uh, real game, real FNAF game. So I meant. Yeah, next time I should write the names. <laughs> no, it's not. Uh, it's not difficult. It's um, across the. Uh, yeah. So let's have a quick look at Across the Street, a FNAF fan game uh, that takes place around uh, FNAF 2. While they were moving the animatronics from um, the old uh, pizza area to the new building. Yeah, that's a. Uh, yeah, we don't care about the story much, but uh, just to, to know where it should uh, fall around. Come on. Full screen. What's going on? Yeah, full screen. Yeah. FNAF across the street. So, we'll start from the beginning. So, uh, yeah, it's... Uh, they're moving, uh, they're finding the old animatronics, bringing them to the FNAF 2 location, etc. Let's go. So gameplay wise it's a bit uh, simple, there's not a lot of stuff to do, just looking around and uh, yeah, kinda like the previous one. Night 1. <laughs> Look at him. Oh man. Hello? 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 Hey Scott, it's me Oliver. Hey Scott. <laughs> the night job. I know it's one of the more uh, interesting jobs over there. One door. But I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Two doors. Uh, boss told me to call you. I see we brought uh, Nintendo or NES uh, to play you know, some play games, games at the at work. We've been really busy over here and don't have any extra time, so this is the best we can do. So as you know. We have the old Fazbear animatronics stored over there in the facility. We were going to use you? them for the new location, but so we're they back were here. Too old, and you know what happened over there was uh, tragic. So we decided against that. Last right here, year. we designed for brand new, more polished and kid-friendly animatronics to use here. But we have to keep the old ones as we plan to use them for extra parts. So, to make sure that they stay in good condition, they're still active. That's why you're here. They're going to be walking around, and we can't let their servos lock up. Now with that, it's state law that any security guard that has to deal with live free run animatronic characters has to have a way to keep them out of their office. 
This was made back when the night guard sued Fred Bears for a close call that could have hurt him. So, to comply with that law, we have the two sliding doors to your left and right. If you see someone outside the door, just close it and their system should restart and you'll go back to where they came from. Now, I wish it was that easy for you, but unfortunately, a friend of mine was working there the week before. He reported some odd behavior. The bunny, he acts normal. He might walk to your left door. And if you see him there, just close the door. Now, Chica, bunny left door? The yellow chicken, she's sneaky. She'll wait on camera five and sneak up on the door. If you see Chica on camera five, just close the right door. She'll try to sneak up on the door and hold it open. And if you see her in your office, it's too late. Alright? Alright. All right. So remember to check camera five, close the doors if you see anyone, and you'll be alright. Great. That's it for today. Good night. Good night. I don't get the fence exactly. So Bunny comes from here. Chica, she comes from here. Right now, she, she's uh, right there. And that's it for the first night. Let's play some men, yes. Right? No? What is going on? Nothing really much. Yeah, I did it. I reached uh, night two of the previous game, of the fun game. The um, before before Freddy's, and now I'm playing another fun game that takes place around FNAF two while they're uh, they're finding the animatronics. I like these games because they're a bit simple, there's not much gimmicks or stuff, just uh, one door to close another, nothing much to do. And, and yes, uh, that uh, doesn't uh, do much, but it's turned on. Chica's around here, Bunny is nowhere to be seen, oh wait, 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 no, oh, I thought something was there. I'm still not sure what the fences do. Oh, fence four, close this. All right, fence four, it's this. Some nice uh, music. That reminds me of some indie game. Fence 3 is there, okay. 4, 3, yeah, Fence 2, it powers up, alright, alright, you can do anything, you have to wait, Fence 2. Fence do fence two is right here. All right, so this close Chica away. I'm not gonna say I'm pretty good at this, but. Yeah, no, nothing really happened in the first night. <laughs> yeah, pretty easy. What the heck is going on? What the heck is going on? Not a lot of ca fun games do this. What the fuck? Hi, William. It's nice to have you back. Yeah, I wanna kill some kids. <laughs> 
was bad for both of us, so I understand if you're not uh, get the music super loud. Shh. Still uh, not over Elizabeth. It's nice to have you back. Fred Burns may be gone, but Fred is doing great. Rob is Foxy. I've been trying to fix him up. But, uh, uh, uh. Thanks a lot, man. These uh, sprites, uh, the kids dancing. I always come back. Oh, that's nice. That's the security booth. Foxy will be once I got to fix him, alright. I don't even remember that. Look at him go! <laughs> Alright, sure, why not? That was the last time we met. Ooh. Do you remember? I'm sure do. Hello, Mr. Afton! It really has been quite some time. Don't be scared of me. Foxy looks like his wife just left with the kids. Uh, yeah. I will give them life. Ooh. The steel of your own design. Kill more. <laughs> they make killing you easier. Why? Just kill him now. Goodbye, Mr. Afton. I'm sure we meet again. I just want me rum! Horror! Oh, so we move to night two. Alright, I think we're gonna stop right here. Not because of this game, but uh, the last one. I tried uh, one too many times and uh, <laughs> it's a bit too much. I think we'll do some uh, FNAF games from time to time. At least I, w I wanna spotlight the... Continue the sequel. <laughs> At least I want to I want to spotlight some of the nice uh, fun games, but we'll leave at that for now. Right across the street, it's a it's a nice game. This one, it's uh, supposed to be like uh, something going on uh, at the same time as FNAF 2. I like it. We'll try uh, Night 2 next time. All right, let's leave that. Alright, next time we'll try uh, to move uh, forward with the real games and uh, then try something else, alright? So, um, yeah, I think we're gonna end this uh, around the year, so it's, uh, yeah, not bad, 
we did uh, over an hour. I have to try uh, starting the streams a bit earlier. It's uh, yeah, I spent too many times doing uh, checks and tests. So next time uh, we'll try uh, we'll try uh, try starting a bit earlier. And uh, all right, let's play uh, let's play out some music for to end this. Move this. Where's the music? Yeah, I don't remember. But. All right, we'll um, leave it at that right now. I think that's uh, that was uh, nice enough to test some things and uh, yeah, continue the original games uh, show. So um, see you next time. Next time will be on Sunday morning uh, for me <laughs> at least. Uh, we'll do an art stream next time and uh, try to do some uh, comic page. So uh, see you around next time. Thanks for uh, checking by. Thanks, uh, Blackwing. <laughs> yeah. And uh, all right, we'll leave it at that for now. So uh, see ya. It's getting uh, dark here. Uh, so uh, I am losing lights right now. <laughs> so see ya. Around. See ya. Bye.